Hey there, this is Akshin and welcome back to a new video. In the last part, we were seeing this shorthand syntax and I hope that uh, you like that video. From this video, we are starting inheritance and first of all, let me create a new pad. In this video, we may not be seeing a lot of coding part. In the coming video, in the next video, we will be seeing the coding part of the inheritance, right? We will be implementing a lot of inheritance types, single inheritance, multiple. Let's not talk about it right now. Let me first tell you what inheritance is, right? So I'm going to do a simple thing. I'm going to create uh, or I'm going to take two objects. Let's take a mobile phone and let's take a television. Let me write it down. I'm taking mobile phone, right? And then I'm taking a television. Television, right? Now, what can you think about mobile phone? What all things, what all properties does a mobile phone have? Right? Can you think about it? A mobile phone definitely has a height, right? It has a height. It definitely has a width. It has a width. It definitely has some breadth or it you can say thickness, right? So thickness and what, what all things? It has a screen dimension that we have already taken, right? It can have some, um, uh, some aspect ratio, aspect ratio and it can have some properties or what all things can a mobile phone perform it can call you can call through a, a mobile phone right so call is going to be a function right so you can call through a, a mobile phone right then you can play games on your mobile phone now if i talk about a television what all things does a television have television also has a height it also has a width it also has a thickness it also has an aspect ratio but throughout television, you cannot call. So this function is not going to be there for television, right? You cannot play games on a normal television, right? It can be a very high fi smart TV, but on a normal television, you cannot play games. You can watch. You can watch on mobile, on television. Yes. So that's also a function, which all things, I guess that's it, right? You can only do a watching on your television. And these are the properties that, that your television has, right? But what are we doing right over here? I want to tell you that there are certain things that are common between a mobile phone and a television. That is some properties, height, width, thickness, and aspect ratio, and certain tasks that this mobile phone can perform, or you can say functions, right? They are common. Watch is a common function between mobile phone and a television. So whenever you will be creating a class of a mobile phone and you will be creating a class for television, there are going to be certain parameters that are going to be common and there are going to be certain functions that will be common in between, right? So inheritance says that can there be a scenario that a single class denotes uh, or represents these two classes and we can inherit that inherit those properties for mobile phone and television. In general, I want to say that can a class electronics can be there? If I create an electronics class, mobile phone is an electronic item, television is an electronic item. So I can say that I, if I create an electronics class and inside this electronics class, if I define height, width, thickness and aspect ratio once and this watch function once, I don't need to, rep I don't need to define them again for mobile phone and television, right? So this electronics item is going to have this height, width, thickness and aspect ratio right i can cut it i can put it over here and this watch function right and this is also going to be gone from here right this watch and all these things will be gone from here right and only the functions which are unique for a mobile phone they are going to stay right so call is going to stay and games is going to stay because it is not there in electronics for a television, there is no other function that we can think of right now, which is uh, unique for a television, right? So it is, there is no, no uh, definition is going to be there for television. Now what I'm going to do is for mobile phone, I'm going to say that mobile phone extends, extends electronics. Now, as soon as I do this, all the properties which are there and all the functions which are there for electronics, they will be there in mobile phone class also and if i do extends electronics over here also 
all the functions and all the parameters which you can see for electronics they will be a part for television also so this is the sorry this is gone from here yes this is perfect now mobile phone says that all the properties and all the functions for electronics plus call and games television says that all the properties and all the functions of electronics plus there can be something else this is what inheritance says that you can inherit the property of your parent class so electronics is your parent class mobile phone and television are your children classes child classes or you can say that electronics is your base class mobile phone and television are your sub classes right i hope i am clear or you can say super class sub class right you can say parent class child class like this there are there can be number of names you can give right so i hope that uh, this was clear now there can be multiple inheritances right this one is hierarchical because one parent is having two children mobile phone and television so when a parent has two children then we can say that hierarchy is getting created hierarchy so this type of inheritance is called hierarchical inheritance hierarchical inheritance right now another type of inheritance is or the most simple type of inheritance is single inheritance when one parent has a single child you can see mobile phone is the only child of electronics there is no other child so this is called single inheritance now another can be multi level inheritance so let me just control c control v now multi level means multi level means mobile phone let me bring up television also television can extend mobile phone let's say i'm just give an example now what is happening over here mobile phone is a child of electronics television is a child of mobile phone so you can say grandparent parent and then child so multi level right so this is called multi level inheritance i hope i am clear right similarly it can be multiple inheritance so these are the simple types of inheritance that you, that you will be using in your day to day coding for flutter or, or any other language right i hope this was clear in the next video we will be seeing coding examples of these types of inheritance and normal inheritance also i hope i was clear till next content keep coding keep innovating and thanks a lot